Okay, this is water test just from the front. Here we go. So this is what it looks like with the engine compartment uh, open after the front spray test. Uh, there is some water that made it, um, you know, into the engine compartment. Some of this could be just from me spilling things from the hood, but for the most part, everything looks pretty dry from water, you know, at the, the hood to the grill junction. So this is looking at the existing uh, corrosion patterns in the engine compartment. So um, here's the central engine compartment. You can see this looks basically brand new. Like I, I kind of doubt that significant water is either coming through the fan or under the hood. Unfortunately, I cleaned all this up before uh, videoing this. This is the right side uh, near that opening that allows water in uh, uh, by your your heater over here. And I've already cleaned this up, unfortunately, too, but there was substantially more corrosion on the right side. Um, you can see a little bit in the back here. Uh, that's what the whole right side used to look like before I cleaned it. So I think most of the stuff is coming in on the right side uh, through multiple locations rather than directly from the front. So this is the right front uh, fender liner where it meets uh, the body. And you can see there's a pretty generous gap right in here. And there's a, there's a light that I've got in there just to show you what's in there. But what you're looking at is the positive temperature coefficient heater, the PTC heater. And you can clearly see it right there. I suspect a lot of water is spraying in there. And that's what uh, appears to occur when I was spraying the uh, hose up in this area. Interestingly, I did not get a lot of water on the front connectors by spraying down here. However, here's this, uh, this uh, water pump that appears to be a problem, and this probably gets a lot of water on it. Okay, this test is from the wheel well on the right. It's to see if the water um, goes through the wheel well liner and goes on to the PTC positive uh, temperature coefficient heater on the right side. And here's from the inside. There's the PTC heater, pretty obviously getting soaked. Okay, what I'm doing now is I'm just barely heating this up. You can see how it just barely kind of uh, folded over there. And I'm just going to kind of pinch this into the contour that I want. And I'm not really melting this. You could probably use a hair dryer. I'm just... Trying to move quickly, just be cautious if you do use a um, torch like I'm doing. But anyways, you gradually just contour this around the stuff there. And it should be fairly easy to do. Just gradually work from one side to the other.